Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Liz. Thank you for stopping by. I have a PR package today. This is um, a new company to me. It's Outdoor Tide. <clears throat> they reached out to me a few weeks ago. I finally got the product in and I'm going to be doing um, uh, showing you what I have. As you can tell, my voice is still not back to normal. It's I, It's going to be a while. I do feel I do feel better. I do feel better. Not a hundred percent, but I do feel better. Anyway, they sent me two products. I want to show them to you. They look really cute. I did open the bag because I wanted. I needed to know who sent it to me because there was no. There is a return address, but it doesn't say what company. Um, it came just in this plain mailer, and I'll show you that. This one came a little beat up, <laughs> but this, I can easily, this will iron out really easily. Not a problem. And then this one was perfectly, you know, fine. No problem. I don't have an issue with um, most canvases anyway, because I ironed them. Um, they have a special on there or a code on their website. I just checked. It's OutdoorTie.com and it's like 12% off. So that's good. Um, I do not have any codes from them, but they have their specials. So go check them out, you know, especially after you see uh, what I got here. So this is really cute. I really love this one. Here, okay. Put it here. <clears throat> it's stuck. What's going on here? Okay. Got it out. Got it. I thought this was so cute. I'm so, so stinking cute. And it's not very big. I think this was a 30 by 30. Let me unroll. Um, roll it back for you real quick. <clears throat> so you can see it better. Look how cute. It's a little mouse. A Christmas mouse, it looks like. Holding like a cup of coffee. I'm saying it's a cup of coffee because I am a coffee fiend. I love coffee. And I think he is so stinking cute. I mean, how can you not love that cute little face? Okay, so it comes with a basic kit. This has 21 colors. It's all letters. Right there, it's all letters. Let's take a quick peek at the drill feel, which looks perfectly fine. I don't see any issues. I hope this comes out. <clears throat> I actually have... Um, a finish from another company that's a 30 by 30 that came out really good glue on this is really good really good it's got like a almost thicker plastic on it you know but isn't he so stinky look at that adorable little face i love it i think it's so adorable and so stinking cute i just i saw it and i'm like oh my god i love it too cute <clears throat> and I don't even need to show you the thumbnail. You can see that very well. <clears throat> and these are the drills. Um, let's, yeah, I could show them to you like this. Actually, let's put, so you have um, 21 colors. And they're very, this is more like an antique look um, painting. So they're going to be more subtle col colors, which will look really pretty. You know, I think it'll be really nice. And they're all kitted up with the numbers on the bags like that. I like them. These drills look nice, too. They're, they're nice and flat. No pits that I can see. Wow. They look really good. Awesome. So that's that one. Let's see. Okay. The camera. I'm trying to make sure the camera isn't going wonky. <clears throat> because I am really not in the mood to go find a new phone right now. And as long as I can manage with this one, I'm going to. I just, I don't run up to it. Okay, so this one here, I really thought was wicked cute. Um, it is, both of these are Christmas uh, paintings. I like how this one opens sideways. I love when they open like this, because the way I store my paintings, I really like that they open this way. <clears throat> and I can already tell this is going to have a bunch of colors in it. This is anytime I see um, a painting with like the way this is set up, like with the extra thing here, it's hard to tell the 
oh, what do you call it? The legend there. Just the way it's set up, I can tell it's going to be a good amount of colors, usually. Oh, goodness. That was stuck good. Okay. Oh, all right. So, let's see. It is, like, it is, it is kind of beat up. <laughs> it is a little bit beat up. But that one was 30 by 30. I think this one might be 40 by 40. <clears throat> so, this is the kit that comes with it, which is, uh... It's got two multi-placers. You got a four-placer here, and you have, a, that, that looks like a ten-placer in there. You got the cush, you have the um, uh, tweezer, the extra glue, and the um, the tray. I like these trays. Those are my favorites to work with. All right, and it comes kitted up. Let's just go, oh, it's got ABs in it. Nice. I like that. <clears throat> Can you believe it? My voice has been like this for weeks. I'm hoping I don't, you know, start sounding like Rachel Ray permanently. <laughs> All right, so we got this guy here. Isn't he cute? It's a reindeer. So it's got 30 colors. So it's got a good amount of colors because it is only, oh, what's that? 40 by 30. Oh, I thought it was bigger because of the thing, but that's actually a good size. 40 by 30. Um, This one was like maybe eight something. Um... But it, it looks like it might be. Let me let me measure it, because this looks for some reason bigger. So it's an actual thirty. It's an actual thirty, and just slightly under forty. So it's actual size. So it's not the regular twenty-five by by thirty-five. It's it's an actual size. Now it does have all the circles around. Um, let's see. I'm going to bring this up a little closer just so you can see the legend, which it's, it, there's like number one is, is that a question mark? It is, look, almost looks like a seven. So it's got a bunch of symbols, letters. I don't see numbers though. Is that a seven there? Maybe number 26 is a seven. But that looks like that's the only one. And this is what he looks like. Look how cute. I just thought it was adorable. So stinking cute. Um, oh, I'm going to show you the drill field. Let's see here. Oops, I just whacked the camera. Sorry. Let's see if I can stop it from shaking like that. Whenever I move, it, it will do that. But it, that's the drill field. So actually, there is a four in there. I didn't notice that in the seven. Okay. So there's a couple numbers in there. A lot of symbols, letters. As you can see, those circles around there. <clears throat> I think it's going to come out nice. I'm hoping it does. Um, this one will work up quick, I think. Only because it's not very big. And I think it'll look really, really cute. Oh my gosh, so sinking cute. I like, I love that little face. Um, the glue. Let me test the glue for you. Let me just pan out. The glue's really good. It's actually really good. This there's a spot. Okay, yeah. It looked like it got bent back a little bit, but it's fine. So it's it's a really nice painting. Um, the store seems really nice. This is my first experience with them. So um <clears throat> I do like the painting. I don't like that it's this beat up, but like I said, uh, this particular canvas, especially this one, because it's cloth will iron very, very easily. If you're putting it under something, I don't know how how it will. Uh, you, in my honest opinion, this needs to be ironed because that's the only way you're going to get these wrinkles out. I mean, you're never going to get wrinkles out if it's just flat like that, I don't think, especially on cloth. Maybe on regular canvas you could do that, but on cloth like this, mm. watch my video on ironing. Or watch other video on ironing. Just keep the iron on low. Be very careful if you're going to do it. Do it at your own risk. But if it's something that's this wrinkly, this this bad, yeah, it's going to have to be ironed. And that's, for me, it's fine. I don't have a problem with it. I iron 99% of my canvases except my big D D Diamond Art Club canvases. I don't, I've never needed to iron those. I iron all of them. So it's not a problem for me. Anyway. So it's 30 colors. Here is the colors. 
Um, I know some people like the number of the canvas on their thing here. It's not on here. You'd have to put a label. I store my stuff together, so it makes no difference at all to me. So I want to see. Okay, there's nothing here that says which ones are um, ABs. So let's see how many ABs we have in here. <clears throat> and both of these are round. <clears throat> Most of them are going to be round anyway. There's been a couple I've gotten that are square. I think I got one from another company that was square. Okay, it looks like... Oh, we got a few. Hmm. Can't see if there's any more. Okay, so that's no. So as of right now, unless I find some after, there's five. Wow, these are nice too. Let's bring them up closer for you. And I'm gonna turn the light on. So you've got this beautiful rose. I love this color. It, it's such a pretty AB color. Like, it's just beautiful. And then you have this pretty gray, which I like the gray blue AB color. AB color. It's more blue on camera. It's really, it's really more gray. It's more like a slate gray. And you have the pretty red, which I love, which is a 666. And then this darker blue which I, I, I'm i fine with, but it, it's also, it's funny, it's more of a gray color. It looks, let's see if I turn off the light, if it shows up better. It's more a gray. See, that's more true to it, but it looks blue, but it's like a blue gray. And then we have this really pretty um, tan color, which I actually like this color as well in ABs. It always shows up really, really pretty. So that's five ABs, which is really good. And I'm just going to show you a couple of the regular drills just so you can see the quality of them as well. Um, those drills are really nice. Very nice flat backs. Really nice. These are good quality. I, I'm impressed. I'm impressed with this company as far as the who they have printing their stuff because the stuff is nice quality. Uh, drills and the canvases look look like decent quality too um a really good quality i should say you know for a bargain company i think it's nice so anyway this is outdoortide.com go on their um web page and see what they have like i said they have some special running on right now i'm sure they change them up like most of them do um i will put the links for both of these below for you and whenever I get them done, at some point I'll get one or two of them done, I will also do the completion video so just you guys can see. And I'll let you know. As of right now, I'm happy with what I have. And I think in the end, I think I'll be happy with the whole thing. The only thing is I'm not sure is the eyes because it's just black here. But if I look at the picture itself, the eyes are black anyway. I mean, there's a little bit. Hold on. Let me bring it up. Ooh, there's a little bit. Is there, yeah, there looks like a little bit of shine there. So I may have to add like a couple of things here or there, just like a light, like a lighter color or even a little bit of an AB color. You know, um, that's the only thing I'm not 100% sure is how the eyes are going to come out. The rest of it looks great. So, and the eyes, I can manage with that. Not a problem. All right, you guys have a great day wherever you are. Thank you for stopping by. Uh, take care of yourselves. Blessings and thank you.